What is up YouTube? Calvin coming at you from I-95 Muscle. Actually, I'm actually at the Circle K in front of I-95 Muscle. Today we're doing a little walk around on this 1958 Edsel Corsair. And this is actually one of the really, like one of the cooler vehicles that, that I've seen come through the showroom here. Um, overall, the car's in really great condition. Runs and drives awesome. You might notice a couple little flaws, nothing too crazy. Um, but this one has some cool features we'll talk about here in a minute. Uh, we do have 475 engine. Distributors on the front of these. I'm not really familiar with the Edsel stuff, but just like anything from the 50s and 60s, you can tell it's actually quite easy to work on. So we'll go ahead and get this closed down. Looks like we're gonna have to work on closing that. Give me one second. Bear with me. We're making it through all our trials together. We're gonna leave that open for now. Uh, fun fact, it can't uh, fly open on you because it's a reverse mount. I think we have to push the lever inside to get it to close fully, but anyways, this is what the front end looks like on this guy. Definitely a unique look. It's kind of a, a bit of Christine mixed with, well, it's got that, that big Edsel nose that Edsel's known for, so it's pretty cool. There's a front plate mount up there. The paint's in really good shape. We got some wheel covers on there. All the badging and stuff seems to be there, which is really nice. Right here behind where the license plate would mount, there is a little run on either side. This is where your gas cap goes or your gas filler neck. I just did a little picture on my Instagram talking about how kids nowadays are not gonna know what it feels like to be able to park on either side of the gas pump and get gas. So uh, while I'm back here, let's go ahead and pop open this trunk. Oh, come on. And ugh. there we go. So nice clean trunk, interior space. Overall in really good condition and actually I don't know if you can actually tell in the video, but Like there is a lot of trunk space. So I'm 6'1 250 pounds. I could probably fit in there four times over maybe So that's cool And we are gonna go ahead and drive this back on over to the dealership I actually stopped over here to get some Gatorades. It was actually quite hot out today. And I don't know, you might be able to see Mitch over there. Doing photos of the Chevelle right now. Behind the scenes, what's up? All right, let's get on to the cool feature of this guy. So, um, the coolest, weirdest, rarest, awesomest feature on this guy actually is right in the center of the steering wheel. So you'll notice when I turn the wheel, the center doesn't turn. That's because the transmission controller is actually push button, and that's how you put it in gear. So, we'll fire this guy up. She fires right up. Gas gauge works, I put a little gas in it. She revs up pretty good. Has one of them rotary speedometers, which is pretty cool. Um, 87,000 miles on the odometer Haven't really messed with the radio or anything Don't think that's doing much I hear something I don't know if it's good or bad But we'll assume that that doesn't work Ashtray And there, that would be why it doesn't work Well, we got a radio in here I don't know, that's for you to figure out when you buy it. Horn works good. Now, normally you would grab a column and shift it down into drive. That is not the case. Oh yeah, see this hood release was actually pulled out. Let's go ahead and latch that guy real quick. When you pull the hood release, you gotta push it back in. Otherwise it won't latch. Bear with me one second. And she's latched. All right. 
so there's our shifter our shift pattern okay park reverse neutral drive and low now we do got some switches over here courtesy lights turns on your interior lights antenna doesn't do anything okay park drive lights oops sorry park drive lights turns on your headlights um, and really that's it we got blower it's blowing it actually feels kind of cool now because it's cooler outside than it is inside the car let's go ahead and put this window down ah there uh, those of you that follow us religiously I feel sorry that you guys watch all these videos with me breathing heavy and oh that's cool cigarette lighter good luck finding one of them washer and wipers I do not see the wipers working so but let's pop this baby and drive and we're off just fine sounds like it might have a slight exhaust leak nothing too crazy the speedometer looks like it's working pretty cool feature percent guaranteed to get looks everywhere you go I think uh, I think Mitch still has some pictures to do with this guy so I'm gonna pull it over this way towards Mitchell and then, actually why don't you guys come with me we'll deliver We'll deliver a Gatorade. It's delivery. Oh. Delivery. Oh, life saving. Thank you, sir. How much I owe you? $20. No, thank you. Uh, take it back. No. Touched it. All right, guys. That is gonna wrap up this little test drive walk around. And just to prove that reverse works and neutral works, there's neutral, I'm off the brake. We're not going nowhere, reverse. And we're going backwards. Okay, park. Now we're in park. All right, I'll give you one more little glance at her. That top is absolutely beautiful it matches the color on the side all right guys thanks for watching until next time oh make sure you like comment subscribe bye